Ladies and gentlemen, introducing Butterbean. No, I think we I think you're safe in assuming that there is Butterbean. He will race across the ring and attempt to get Monaco down quickly, and by golly, but. Uh, didn't he? And I don't think we'll be seeing the boxer types matched against him. So there's the right hand. That'll be may end up having some longer tough man fights than this one here. Monaco trying to work the jab on the inside. He busted Butterbean with a pretty good uppercut there. And Monaco is uh, built quite well. You can see he's got a bodybuilder's physique. Just the opposite of Butterbean. He lands a good right hand. Oh, there goes Monaco. Second knockdown in this round. So if Monaco survives and goes down a couple more times, we're gonna have a 10-5 round. You gotta use the jab against Butterbean if you're gonna be effective. Monaco, an inexperienced young fighter, I don't know that he has that good a jab. Monaco, not a skilled boxer, as you can see, leading with the right hand there. One, two, let's go. this fight. Butterbean gets the job done. He threw three right hands and got three knockdowns. Into the fight. And good night with that. And all along, we didn't see any combinations from Butterbean. We no. saw him load up. <laughs> we never see combinations. And I suspect that we will see opponents with a higher skill level in uh, some subsequent fights. Yeah, I'm sure they're working toward that. And but you do see what happens when he gets a clear shot. It's home run derby. He's a big, strong man. I mean, there's no question about that. And if he hits you on the chin... I suspect that we will see opponents with a higher skill level in uh, some subsequent fights.